Welcome to the first section of this class where we take the um <clears throat> we'll take the basic introduction of in Photoshop interface. So here in my screen I have the Photoshop CC 2019 which I'll be making use of throughout this class. So first when you open up Photoshop C2019 this is what you get but I guess this startup screen start from the version 2017 up to 2019 but for now I'm making use of 2019 so we'll go with it 2019 but if you're Photoshop it's not like this no need to worry because everything will be fine because this is the basic and it's a step-by-step -step tutorials or which tutorial of which we can go to so when you first open up photoshop this is what you get when you start working you get all the works you've worked here and so that's just the startup screen for you i don't mind into the detail because i just i just want this how i want it to be but you can switch it from this two icon you have at the top right of your screen so in here you have two ways of creating a new document of which if you want to so we have we can go ahead and make use of the create new or you go up here and go to file <clears throat> and you click on new of which this is what i'll be making use of after which if you are not making use of 2019 version so that's really cool for you so okay if you want to create a new file you go to new go to file and hit on new and um just go and open up the windows for you and sorry if my pc is a little bit laggy i've got so many stuff running on the background which i can't cancel now and i really wish to do that but anyway let's just go ahead so i'm just going to click on any default setup that i have here and hit on create because this is not all about creating a document it's all about the interface of photoshop okay so when you look at mine it's a little bit different from yours right now so what i'm going to do i'll just quickly go over to windows and i go to workspace and i will hit on word essential default because that's where that this is the word way photoshop comes when you just install photoshop maybe it's not like that in yours but this is how it is in mine okay so now when you look up here we have the word files edit image layers and what so on which we can use to what add more functions into our photoshop document or whatever it is we are working on at that moment in photoshop and at the right part at the left part sorry to say at the left part we have our tools our tool shelf or our tool bar or our tool panel we can call it anything you like but most of the times i call it my tool panel so here we have various tools which we can use in photoshop to achieve a desired work or whatever it is you want to do and right here we have our workspace and this place where we have the white background on it it's known as the canvas in photoshop and when you come down to the right hand part we have the colors we have the swatches we have the word length tab that is if you want to go ahead and lend online it's all new and we'll have the libraries and if you're connected to the um, creative clouds and so when you get to sync stuff online so that you won't be able to lose one files or the other from one place so right here we have the adjustment of which you can use to adjust various items or features like the curves levels hue saturations and so on of your choice and coming down to the bottom part we have the layer part where whatever work you do or whatever thing you do in photoshop or anything else you can create a shape or create one thing or the other it's going to appear which is the word the layer part so i guess that's going to be it for this tutorial just a little introduction into the photoshop interface then in our next tutorial we'll go in depth of explaining the tools and explain the tools or understanding the tools in photoshop so i hope you enjoyed this tutorial and make sure not to miss the next class see you guys in the next class